Hello, hello. And I'm, hello, uh, sorry. Yeah, I'm trying to do too many things at once. Uh, English Conversation 1, hello. I'm just going to show you a quick uh, slideshow and explanation of our assignment 2 and 3. It's a two-part assignment, so I think it's a little different and maybe a little confusing. So we're going to go over it very quickly. Hey, my camera is staying on top. That's fun. So assignment two is the written assignment, just like assignment one. Fill in the paper, email it to me, done. Right, and, oh. All right, sorry, I just added the due date there. So that is Saturday, October 21st, okay? It's the due date for that. And then assignment three is going to be the presentation. Uh, I have four conversation one classes, so they're going to be on different days. I will let you know on band which day is your presentation day. But yeah, don't worry about it too much. Uh, so we are doing a show and tell project for the class. This is where you show the class something and tell us about that. And that's what's very important. Like, uh, this to help you talk about things that you like. So again, I'm going to show the class something. I'm not just going to say something, right? Uh, you can bring a picture or the actual thing. Oh, this will count as our second and third assignments. So this is the written part is assignment two. In class, doing the presentation is assignment three. The second assignment is the written part. So again, the second assignment is the written part. The third assignment is presenting to the class. Okay, so talking to the class is going to be your third assignment. Count as assignment three. Assignment two is the writing. Oh, there we go. You do not have to use the outline in assignment two for your presentation. So again, if you just want to talk about something for a few seconds, that's absolutely fine. You do not have to follow assignment two to do the presentation. It is only there to help you. It's helpful. I think if someone speaks English a lot, they probably don't need it and they'd rather just talk. That's fine. Just remember, introduce yourself, talk about the thing, and then say thank you for listening at the end. Remember to bring what you were talking about or a picture of what you're talking about. Again, so. I'm going to do a sample presentation. I will talk about this. So I'm showing you this right now. And for your presentation, you can bring the actual thing you're talking about, or you can bring a picture, or even Google a picture is fine. A lot of people do that. They go on Google, they type in, oh, you know, I'm going to talk about my car. They find a picture of the car. Hey, perfect. Yeah, no problem. Remember to bring what you're talking about or a picture of what you're talking about. The class should see. What's really important is that the class can see what you're talking about, okay? This is partly to prepare you for the final presentation starting in week 12. So in week 12, we have our final presentations. These are longer presentations. This one can be very short. I think today I did it and it took me uh, 27 seconds. So we're, I usually say close to a minute, but like, yeah, just not really, really short. If you call, come up and you say, hi, my name is Tim. I like dogs. And then you sit down, you get zero for that, right? So make sure you actually do the presentation. Like all other assignments, this is pass fail. So if you make an effort, I will give you 100%. So if I think, oh, okay, well, this person tried their best, yeah, 100%. Don't worry about it. Yeah. You do not have to say every little thing perfectly, right? This is conversation one. I think it goes up to conversation four. So, yeah, this is still pretty basic level. Uh, you don't need to worry about, like, having every single thing absolutely perfect. What I really want you to do is just talk about something in front of the class, something you're interested in in front of the class. So you only need to say a few sentences for the presentation. So again, the 
the oh no i broke it on the sheet it it has 10 questions so you'd say 10 sentences and then hopefully at the end you would say thank you for listening so that's 11 sentences that's like 30 seconds it takes me about it might take other people longer depending how much more you say this presentation should be informal interesting and fun right so it is not a very formal presentation we want it to be interesting and fun so i will do a sample presentation for you right now okay so here we go oh i can't uh, oh uh, 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 there you go and yeah as you can see i'm on the computer so i've got my glasses on uh let's actually jump over to but oh my computer's not responding now that's fun eh. all right so we're going to look at this is your assignment too right so i'm going to try and use this as my outline as well so again i'm just going to say the answers to the questions that and that's all you really need to do okay so hello my name is joe i'm going to be talking about this pikachu doll that my son has it looks uh it is what does it look like it's yellow it has a yellow and brown tail also it has like kind of rabbit ears i got it from uh lote mart i got it about I think two months ago from Lotte Mart, uh, it doesn't actually do anything. It's just really cute and it looks like Pikachu. Its tail can move. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't ever use it. It is my son's. So um, he just puts it on the shelf because he likes Pikachu. Uh, we keep it on the shelf actually right behind me here on the shelf. That's where we keep it. I like it because it makes my son happy, and I think it is very cute. Um, so in ending statement, uh, thank you for listening. Hey, there you go. Boom. Done. And that's the whole thing right there. I think that only takes about 30 seconds. Again, I say uh, approximately a minute. All that's really important is that um, you uh, don't like only say like, one sentence or two sentences right so also i have more i meant to show you these and then i got too hung up yeah we got an eevee and a mimi q also this pig one i don't know what the pig is called but yeah so anyway we have a whole bunch of them but yeah anyway i will and hopefully that's helpful as like an outline again this is supposed to be a very relaxed presentation all you really need to do is just like tell us about something say hello my name is tell us about something and then at the end say thank you for listening some kind of ending statement so thank you for listening is perfect right there you you can use that if you want to anyway thank you very much and i will see you guys later yeah, see you in the presentations. So, bye-bye.